Ishaq from India, he says, what's the ruling on re, um, uh, um, narrating or reading a hadith by the meaning and not by the actual words? It's an issue of dispute. Some scholars say that this is not permissible. Because in the hadith of Al-Bara ibn Azib, may Allah be pleased with him, when he was taught by the Prophet ﷺ the dua to say before going to bed, after making wudu and sleeping on your right side, the Prophet told, told him ﷺ to say at the end, آمَنْتُ بِكِتَابِكَ الَّذِي أَنزَلْتِ وَبِنَبِيِّكَ الَّذِي أَرْسَلْتِ I believe in the book you have revealed and in your Prophet you had sent. Now Prophet sent. So Bara ibn Azib repeated the whole dua, but at the end he said, وَبِرَسُولِكَ الَّذِي أَرْسَلْتِ I believe in the book that you have revealed and by the messenger you had sent. Because sent is more associated to messengers. So the Prophet corrected him and said to him, والسلام, no, by the, uh, uh, and in the Prophet you had sent, not the messenger. Which led some scholars to say, ah, we have to stop exactly at the specific word that was used in the hadith and we cannot mention it by the meaning. But the vast majority of scholars say that it is permissible for someone who knows the meaning of the hadith truly. So if I know the hadith truly and understand it and rephrase it or translate it into English, that would be fine, inshallah, because I have knowledge and I'm conveying what was uh, uh, the intention of the Prophet ﷺ. Sometimes, and this was, and I, I told this so many times, in America I was reading a hadith that was translated by one of the imams there. And this is the best that the imam could do, but this is wrong. The hadith of the seven who are martyred other than those who die on the battlefield. Among them, the word is al matun al matun can mean the one who is stabbed with a knife, but also it means, and this is what the hadith is referring to, the one who dies with the plague. So the gentleman translated it to the one who was stabbed. Imagine me reading this hadith, not knowing any better. Someone comes to mug me with a knife and he says, give me a wallet or, or, or I'll stab you and kill you. He said, no, 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 go ahead, stab me. I'd like to die as a martyr. This is not true. Well, this is what he translated to. So saying it with the meaning is permissible if you know the meaning. Rashid from 